happy people i'm back with another video and today i have a small young nails haul for you all um this video is super late but i did shop the young nails february sale where they said that they had a new grab bag so i was really excited to see what was included in the grab bag because i did do their black friday mystery boxes and absolutely love them so i wanted to see what they might have had in their grab bags then i also picked up two acrylic powders that i had been wanting to try so i already opened up the box here and i did open up the two acrylics as well but this is how it came packaged so these are the two powders that I purchased separately and then this here is the mystery box I have not opened up the mystery box yet I wanted to open it with you all here on camera but first let me go ahead and show you all the two colors that I got I really enjoy the young nails acrylic powders so I did want to pick up a few more colors so I did pick up the color cover earth and this is what cover earth looks like I feel like Cover Earth would be a really good nude for my skin tone. So that's why I picked this up. And then I also picked up Cover Taupe, which I thought was a really cute gray color. So yeah, I thought this was a really nice color. So I picked this up as well. I will be swatching these two colors at the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, I just wanted to pick up more of their acrylic powders. It was on sale and I did get the 45 gram containers. So yeah, I got these. And then this is the grab bag. So it does say um, February grab bag here on the box. Okay. And yeah, I was just curious to see what they might have included in here. So yeah, I'm going to unbox this with you all here on camera. Okay. All right, so right off the bat, I see a nail liquid. So this is the Young Nails Monomer. So this is a six ounce monomer. You can never have too much of this. I actually, well, I have a ton of it now. I have four of these now with the huge 32 ounce bottle that came um, in the Black Friday Mystery Box. So I have plenty of monomer to continue practicing my acrylic application. I am new to acrylic, so I wanna perfect that application. And I actually recently got a silicone practice hand, so I'm excited that um, I'll be able to practice on my silicone hand because um, application, shaping, filing, all that stuff, I need to get better at. So yeah, have a nail liquid here. Okay, we also have, let's see what's in here. Okay, so we have the a conversion top coat, and it looks like we got a conversion base coat. So conversion base and top. So these are used with their slick pour powders um, for an alternative to dip liquids. And then I've seen on their channel too that you can also use these conversion um, products for. Um, if you want to turn a regular polish into a gel polish i've not used actually i have a set of this already i haven't used it um as of yet but um i do really enjoy dip powders using gel polishes so i don't mind having a backup set of this because exclusively that's really how i like to do dip but here's the consistency of it um i feel like the top coat is of a thicker consistency here i don't know if y'all can see it's a slow drip here so that is the top coat and then let's see the consistency of the base here okay the base is even thicker so that's good i actually like working with thicker formulas so that is what that looks like okay so these are things so far that i got in my black friday mystery box but let's see what else we got here okay we have i see some confetti in here oh, okay i guess the confetti got everywhere so I see here that we got a speed clear. So again, something else that I got in my Black Friday mystery box, but I guess you can have, you can never have too many staple items. So a speed clear. And then it looks like they included a file. So here's the 180 file. It looks like there's the, the sponge. Okay, it's the 180, so it's the hard and then also the sponge file. Okay. And then the last three things I see here, looks like these are some glitters. Okay, so yeah, so we have this beautiful fiery orange glitter. It is called Strange Times. This is really pretty though. 
Yeah, that's a really pretty glitter. That's a really pretty fiery orange glitter. Okay. Let's see what else. We also have this kind of baby blue and pink glitter. It is in RSVP. No. Okay, so that's what that looks like. It's really cute though. Nice little baby blue shimmer here. That's something that I feel like will go really cute with the set that I have on on this hand. So, okay. Nice springtime colors. And then the last one here is Incoming, which looks very similar to the other one. And this is like, uh, I guess it's kind of like more of a peach color. It has some gold in it. It's peach, gold, and light blue. Again, would look really cute with the set that I have on. But let me see the last color here. Okay, let's put those side by side. I mean, they're different, but they're similar enough to where I'm not like, you know, jumping out of my shoes all excited about. So, I mean, overall, I feel like the February grab bag was like, was a little boring so to speak i hate to say that but it was nothing really too exciting in here like out of all the items that i received i think the most exciting thing to me was maybe this like fiery orange um glitter um but you know having so i follow young nails on youtube and instagram and i really love the company i really love their products they're very high quality especially their acrylics but i feel like young nails is a company that, that likes to play it safe um, so they like to be safe rather than sorry. And so I think they included safe items here in this grab bag. So I feel like when I look at the items here, I feel, I think safe. So yeah, these are the items that was included in the February grab bag from Young Nails. Um, it was valued at $35 and I think it was supposed to be a total of $75 worth of products in here. Do I feel like I got my money's worth with the $35? Uh, yes and no. I mean, retail price for these items, I think this retails at $20. This retails at like $12. These glitters, I think they normally are like $5 a pop. Um, this here, I believe maybe, maybe between 10 and $15. So, I mean, each one of these are probably between 10, $15 each. So yes, it was a $75 value, but it's not 75. So yes, it's a $75 value that I got for $35, but in all honesty, um, I would have probably preferred to have just spent the $35 on maybe purchasing some more of their different acrylic colors that I maybe wanted to try out. Um, so I am happy that I picked up the Cover Earth and the Cover Taupe as well. So yeah, if you all want to see um, what the Cover Earth and Cover Taupe looks like, as well as what the Glitters Swatch looks like, um, stay tuned to the very end of the video and I'll just add that as an extra clip um, at the very end. Okay, so. Oh, these are what all the colors look like swatched so this again is cover earth really really like this cover a lot especially as a nude for someone with the darker skin tone this is what it would look like if it was glossy here is cover taupe again this is a really nice gray color um, kind of low-key mauvey really like this color as well happy to have this in my collection um, this here is one of the glitters. This is RSVP No. I'll be honest, the glitters I'm not really that impressed with. Um, I don't really see myself reaching for them that often, but they're here. It's a cute like pink and baby blue, baby blue, baby pink color. Um, the only time I could really see myself wanting to use these is if I was maybe doing some like, you know, uh, baby shower nails or something. Um, the next one here is Incoming. Um, and this is just another kind of pink and blue mixture here. That's what it would look like with the top coat. And then I just washed this one so it's still kind of wet. But this is Strangest Times, which I really do like this color. That's what it would look like wet. But again, I'm not... The glitters I'm not that impressed with. So yeah, these are how all the colors look swatched. Um, Again, I will say that um, I wasn't that impressed with the February grab bag. I do think that if I had a do-over, I probably would have, have just spent that $35 purchasing more of maybe their cover, their colored acrylic powders or some of their cover, more of their cover powders just to kind of build that collection because I would rather have those 
and to have these glitters that I probably would never use. Um, I was happy though that they included like more nail liquid and some um, clear. So I mean, I guess you can never have too much of that. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, if you all are interested in the looks that I have here on my hands, I will have tutorials to both of these videos linked down in the description box. Um, these are like my spring nails. So yeah, I'll leave that link down in the description in case you all are curious about how I got the look to these two sets. I had so much fun making them, you guys. Um, so yeah, um, I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular are my Nail Therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails. And so yeah, if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I would love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.